so hi guys hello and welcome back to the channel this is your voice one signing in for a brand new video from the capital city of karnataka the silicon valley of india bengaluru bengalurians call it nama bengaluru which stands for r bengaluru today we'll be traveling from kesar bengaluru all the way till talagupa is 16227 that is mysuru talagupa express Guys, this is the locomotive in lead for our train today. That is Krishnashpuram's WDP 4D, road number 40253, is leading our 16227 Mysore Talagupa Express. And we rail fan call this locomotive livery as the police bus livery. Mysore Talagupa Express, Mysore Sri Talagupa, Jani Wali, Gadi, Shankar, Platform. and that's the announcement of our train and our scheduled departure is at 2315 hours that is 1115 pm and this is what i was talking about the dharwad case are bengaluru vande bharat now being shunted on to pit line crossing with ajmer mysore express arriving at our first scheduled halt maleshwaram station code mwm 3 kilometers have been covered from ksr bengaluru 1 minute of halt is provided at maleshwaram covering 5 kilometers from ksr bengaluru we have reached our second scheduled halt that is eshanpur station code ypr for platform 6 mysore talagopa express has 2 minutes of halt here and we are running late by 5 minutes on platform number 3 is our train that is mysore talagopa express and on platform number 1 one of my favorite trains eshanpur delhi sarai rohila tufan duranto Cruising at 85-90 kmph per hour, uh, despite being 110 as the speed limit on this section. Crashing to one or a flat hundred. Kilometers from KSR Bengaluru, we have reached Tumakuru Station Code TK. Number of platforms four. As per the records, the name Tumakuru is derived from various different words, from tamate, musical instrument, or tumbe hua, a kind of flower which is grown here. accelerating from tumkuru heading towards r next scheduled halt tiptur a land famous for its coconut plantation and by the way tumkur has also got another name called kalpataru nadu the land of coconuts so guys good morning welcome back to the channel it's 3:36 currently and we are at tarikere as per where is my train we uh, we arrived tarikere at, at 321 am and we had to reach here at 343 and we are running 
approximately 20 minutes ahead of scheduled arrival time tarike station code tre number of platforms 2 total number of halting trains 24 tarike popular places for plantation of betel nuts rk nuts or many other commercial crops till b2 junction we were on bangalore hubali main line from b2 we have taken a diversion towards this the starter is given and departing from tarikere okay uh, till virur we were on bangalore hubali main line and from virur we have taken a diversion towards virur talagupa line or also known as the shivmoga line this is a single line section departing from tarikere at 345 we reached Tarikere at 3.20 which meant we were running ahead of 23 minutes. There is a popular Kannada tongue twister based on this place, Tarikere. It says Tarikere Eri Mele Muru Kari Kuri Mari Vyodhitu which means on the banks of Tarikere there were three little black baby sheep grazing crossing over river Badra and approaching our scheduled halt Badravati welcome to the iron city the industrial city and the city of paper mills of Karnataka, Bhadravati, station code BDVT, number of platforms 2, total number of halting trains 24. This lies on the river banks of river Bhadra. So after covering 255 kilometers all the way from KSR Bengaluru, we have reached Bhadravati. And surprisingly, we are running ahead by 28 minutes. We were scheduled to arrive Bhadravati at 4.28 in the morning and depart at 4.30, 2 minutes of halt. But Due to the excessive time and the priority given to this train, we are ra now running ahead by 28 minutes. We reached Badravati at 4 am. According to the history books, this place has got various other names which later evolved toward to Badravati. Firstly, this place was known as Benkipura, the village of fire. Later on, this was again renamed as Venkipura in Sanskrit. Venki means turn where the river Badra takes a 90 degree rotation east and again towards west using the water resources from river Badra and iron ore extraction from Kemangundi iron ore Karnataka government has been successful in setting up MISL which stands for Mysore Iron and Steel Limited later renamed and currently called as Vishweshwaraya Iron and Steel Limited as well as the famous thing which Badravati is known for its paper mills set here. These are the two main industries of Badravati. VISL Vishweshwaraya Iron and Steel Limited has, has built and ground in 1960 and that ground is now a cricket ground which hosts Ranji Trophy and a pride moment where it hosted two matches for Karnataka and a famous cricketer who played for India as well. Gundappa Vishwanath or nicknamed as Vishi is also from this place and many other actors from Kannada industries are also from here like Dodana, actor comedian in Kannada film industry and S. Narayan the same actor comedian and director in Kannada film industry. Also, Banahatti Parameshwarappa Dakshayani, a person who was Deputy Project Manager for India's MOM mission. It stands for Mars Orbiter Mission. ISRO made the whole country proud because it was the first space agency to reach Mars in its first attempt, where all the big other agencies took multiple attempts, India did it at its first attempt.
शिवमगर तुमकूर एक्सप्रेस विथ के जी एम डब्ल्यू डी पी फोर डिपार्टिंग फ्रॉम भद्रावती एट शार फोर थर्टी ए एम crossing over river tunga as i showed you previously near uh, badra railway station both river badra and tunga merges at a point forming a new river called tunga badra which later continues its journey in andhra pradesh and telangana and we have reached shivmogga town station code sm80 and please make sure guys two different stations almost with the similar name here one is the shivmogga and shivmogga town if you want to enter the city with a proper connection then you need to deboard at shivmogga town and you will get various public transports as well as autos to reach destination shivmogga it's also known as the gateway of malnad shivmogga the name as per the history books the name has been derived from different words shiva the lord shiva came here to quench his thirst by by taking a sip in the river tunga and mogga he used a tool to drink water and that tool is known as mogga hence this place was named as shiva mogga two poets of kannada literature who won kannada gnanapeetha prashasti winners are from this place one is the u r anandamurthy and the other rashtra kavi shri ku m po which stands for kupalli venkatappa kutappa he is also from this place not exactly from shivmogga he is from a village tirthalli called kupalli which comes under shivmogga district from ksr bengaluru we have covered 274 kilometers and we are now running ahead by 10 minutes at shivmogga for 16227 mysore talagupa express has a total of 5 minutes halt its scheduled arrival time is at 4 am and departure time is at 4 5 am Malgudi days was shot here uh, with four different season 1986 1987 1988 then a long break 2006 24th september 1986 was the first episode of Malgudi days at arasalu 1 2 was directed by shankar nag and this is the malgudi days museum which was recreated by southwestern railways during day time it will be open to general public and they can visit this station till now i was on board 
sleeper coach now as uh, diesel locomotive is in late plans have changed uh, anandapuram railway station is coming now and quickly i'll head into general coach uh, that is towards the locomotive i'll capture the videos and one more plan change is that uh, at the beginning i told we'll be traveling till talaguppa plan has been cancelled and we'll be only traveling till sagara because uh, we have planned some exciting so stay tuned for that we are at anandapuram only one minute of halt is provided but due to non clearance issues we are still at anandapuram This is the coach I'll be on board to capture the beautiful humming and acceleration of WDP 4D. left loop line is clear a tremendous journey behind the EMD locomotive and a beautiful night journey all the way from Bengaluru till Sagara we have completed a staggering amount of 355 kilometers from Kesar Bengaluru to Sagara so 
This was our locomotive in lead from KSR Bengaluru to Sagara. The journey experience part. Uh, the journey was 9.5 on 10. The coaches were clear. There is no issues regarding security issues nor uh, any technical issues. And coming to the availability, seat availability part, during the weekends you might find a bit difficult to find seats, but during weekdays you will easily get a seat on this train. As a total of 11 sleeper coaches, two AC three tire coaches, one AC second class, and one H1 that is the first AC coach. So now let me tell you why I was fined rupees 350 rupees. Uh, that's because uh, my ticket was stuck in waiting list 1 and I booked when it was waiting list 25 but uh, during chart preparation and the chart got prepared but mine was stuck at waiting list 1. So I took a general ticket which costed me 125 rupees and boarded a sleeper coach and took the permission from the TTE that I would be travelling because tra I'm not travelling alone, I'm travelling with my friends. Their tickets got confirmed except mine. I was the only one who got stuck at waiting list 1. Hence, the TTE minus the amount to pay uh, the remaining amount, the fine amount minus the amount which I paid in the general class. That was the reason why I was fined. If you have any emergencies to travel, then you can use this method. If you like my presentation, please do consider like the video. If you like my content, please do consider subscribing to the channel for more such content. This is your voice one. Signing off from Sagara. Beautiful contents and exciting contents are coming. So stay tuned for that. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.